murder victim's family claims the New Mexico court system failed. Prosecutors accused 19-year-old Jacob Sanchez of beating a man to death, but instead of being locked up until the trial begins, Sanchez is free. News 13's Kelly Lavoie is live from the Newsplex with more. 51-year-old Jose Sassetta was brutally beaten last December. Sanchez was locked up in Valencia County Detention Center until a Valencia County judge ruled to release him. The Sassetta family is scared and worried for the public's safety. He should be in there paying for what he did. He murdered somebody. He took somebody's life. Jose Saceda was found dead in the front yard of the suspect's home. Deputies believe Sanchez beat Saceda after an argument. Sanchez was in custody at the Valencia County Detention Center awaiting trial for five months until Judge John Pope with Valencia County District Court released him to a third-party custody, his grandmother. Saceda's family is outraged. Saceda's daughter, Crystal Baca, says her entire family fears for their safety. He knows my family. He knows where we live. Baca thinks the public is also in danger. To the people out here in the community, you know, just be careful, you know, because this, this guy is not, you know, not, don't trust him. You know, he's a danger. I don't even know why he's out here. Saceda's wife, Shirley, says the court system screwed up and that a man facing second-degree murder charges should be locked up. Justice for me is keeping him in there until he goes and pays the price for what he did to my husband. District Attorney Lemuel Martinez says the state argued Sanchez should remain in custody, but the judge disagreed. We argued strenuously, vigorously against it, but... You know, sometimes that happens. Over the phone, Judge Pope told me Sanchez faces serious charges, but it wasn't premeditated. He has no criminal history, and he doesn't appear to be a threat to the community. Judge Pope says it doesn't make sense to keep him locked up in the Valencia County Detention Center. Unless he breaks his conditions of release, Sanchez will be out on the streets until his trial begins in September. Back to you. Okay, Kelly, the Sanchez family maintains Jacob is innocent, and they say time will prove it.